Hello, my little friends. How are you? We have missed you for the last two days that the school was on holiday. I hope you all are well and you enjoy your school very much. Yes, yes. I have been to your school, making all the cleanliness to be done properly, and I was keeping your classrooms intact. so that you will come on monday and enjoy your school to make you happy on sunday we have collected a small video for you please watch this video and be happy wish you a very very happy sunday thank you once they lived a pot maker named murari in a village called mahadevpur he would make pots sells them in the market and with the earnings he would raise his family he had three pots in his home one day the three were talking to each other like this friends we have been friends like this since very long time i wish from my whole heart to live together like this forever i wish the same my dear friend but i don't wish to live here anymore How long should we stay here in a poor family like this? I wish someone to take me from here. When the three pots were talking to each other, a rich man arrived to the pot maker. Listen man, I want one nice good pot. See sir, I don't have good pot or bad pot. All the pots are good. Whichever you want, you can take it sir. Please, don't mind. I don't want a new pot but I want old one. Old one? But sir, I have all the new pots except the three pots which I am already using. Whatever it is, I want an old pot. The man was firm on his word. Murari had no choice but to show him the three pots. Amongst the three, the rich man chose the third pot. On this, the third pot says to the other two, "Look, my wish is fulfilled." I am going with the rich man now. Saying this, the third pot feels happy. The rich man pays money to Murari and takes the pot home. The pot feels very happy to be there. Days go by. One day, when the owner was filling the water in the pot, the pot gets broken from the top. Oh, I brought this old pot thinking it will be stronger when compared to the new one but look at this it's broken now it is of no use to me i should throw it the rich man keeps the pot away from home the pot feels so sad and says to self oh no what should i do now he left me abandoned i was happy with my friends but now i have no one to be called as mine the pot sadly cries just then an old man passes by and sees the pot he lifts the pot and takes it home while the man was walking towards home the pot thinks in its mind where he might be taking to a broken pot like me the old man keeps it home fills water in it regularly and drinks every day the pot asks the old man sir i am broken and i don't look good why did you bring me home you could have bought a new one for yourself uh, i can't afford to buy a new pot and if you are broken you are satisfying my thirst that's more important moreover one's appearance matters nothing as long they are beneficial to others remember it okay appearance is not at all a matter you are absolutely right sir i was wrong i always thought staying with a rich man will increase my value but the truth is It doesn't matter where we are. It's important how much we are beneficial for them. The pot gets its lesson. Since then, it starts living happily. 
After few days, the old man brings the other two pots home. Pot three felt happy to see them. Prince, how come you both are here? We got scratches on us. Our owner kept us away from home. This kind old man brought us here. Meanwhile, the old man gets two plants and puts them in both the pots and waters them every day. Friend, you wanted to go with the rich man to be happy. But finally, the poor old man made you realize you are still beneficial. When rest of the people thought you are useless, not only you but also to us. Now I understood looks are not important but what we do for others is, be it rich or poor. Since then the three friends stayed together happily with the old man.